The number of cases from across the world shows that people of all ages can contract the COVID-19 disease. But the risk of becoming severely ill with the coronavirus appears to increase above 60 years. According to the WHO, those with pre-existing non-communicable diseases also appear to be more vulnerable to becoming severely ill with the virus. These non-communicable diseases include cardiovascular diseases, people with hypertension, persons who have had or at high risk for a heart attack or stroke are more vulnerable towards COVID-19. Chronic respiratory diseases Patients with chronic lung disease such as asthma, chronic obstructive pulmonary disease and pulmonary fibrosis are also at risk. Diabetes People with diabetes should take particular precautions with respect to COVID-19 as they already have a slightly immunocompromised state. Cancer People suffering from cancer are particularly vulnerable to respiratory pathogens and severe pneumonia because of their immunosuppressive state. Apart from people with underlying health conditions, smokers are also likely to be more vulnerable towards COVID-19. During the act of smoking, the fingers are in contact with lips, which increases the possibility of transmission of virus from hand to mouth. Smokers may also already have lung disease or reduced lung capacity, which would greatly increase risk of serious illness. Smoking products such as water pipes often involve the sharing of mouthpieces, which could facilitate the transmission. Conditions that increase oxygen needs or reduce the ability of the body to use it properly will put patients at higher risk. As with everyone else, the only strategy to prevent infection is social distancing and maintaining good hygiene, especially frequent hand washing using soap and sanitizer.